Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Hope you all are doing well. By Allah's almighty grace, inshallah. Rabbi shrah li sadri wa yassir li amri. Wahlu lubbitam min lisani yafkaku kawli. Welcome back to episode 18 of Forget and Sunnah series. Today's Forget and Sunnah, my brothers and sisters, is about Tahiyyatul Masih. First of all, Tahiyyatul Masih is a Sunnah according to many scholars. It's not obligatory, it's a Sunnah only. In Sahih Muslim, uh, it's quoted that Abu Qatada reported that the Prophet Muhammad said, When one of you enters the mosque or masjid, let him not sit until he has prayed two rakahs. <clears throat> so, in this hadith, the Prophet Muhammad said that when a Muslim enters into a mosque, let him not sit until he offers two rakahs. Even if the Juma, if, even if the khutbah of Juma prayer has started, he should pray the two rakahs because that's the requirement. We should not sit in the mosque without praying two rakahs of Tahiyyatul Masjid. Until and unless, if there is a prayer already going on, uh, then we are not allowed to pray it. Otherwise, if there is no prayer going on, the first requirement or the first intention we should have in our heart it is to pray two rakahs of Tahiyyatul Masjid. Tahiyyatul Masjid is even allowed in times when other prayers are not allowed, such as uh, during sunset, after Asr, and during sunrise. So it's one of the important sunnahs which we Muslims should follow as much as possible. I hope you guys will implement this in your life from today, inshallah, whenever you go to masjid. Remember me and my family in your prayers. Jazakallah khair. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh.